slow start here. We'll be going once again towards B. Only Vanity here, and Taco can't find the shot. That really almost loses them the round instantaneously. Again with the Molotov doing the damage. And Smoo is also here to pick up the pieces. Two quick kills from both of those defenders. And now Fallen with the AWP on one versus five. This is not going to happen. The bomb dropped all the way in the open. Maybe with the bomb on his back, he can open up one of these bomb sites and make it a little more exciting. But, oh, apparently not the case. So nothing getting done just there. Awkward round again from MIBR. You see, as soon as Taku loses that shot, loses that opening jewel, the Molotov is placed and nobody's able to capitalize or punish. Obviously, just with pistols on that B bomb site, it's really hard to hold up and come through. Still three on the defense over towards the A bomb site, and still Mayan over by Ivy. A couple of taps on through, but no connections yet. And Chaos are getting precariously close. Here comes Smuya. Couple of headshots. Oh, and there's another one. Three fast frags. That's the whole of the A bomb site cracked open. And now Mayan and Taco, they need to get everything done, but it's Smuya again. Four fast frags. He's doing everything in this C pistol. And Taco, he's going to have to go for the wraparound. I think Steel might even find him here. It's a quick headshot to finish. 10 to 6 here for Chaos. And they now only need 6 to finish. Beautiful stuff. What a god on the save bomb site. Look at these shots. Just chasing up the ladder. And a third headshot found into KNG there. And, and just converting onto all of these frags. That Glock's so, so powerful. And single-handedly winning that round. Even at all costs, as KNG and Taco are both here. And third from behind could cause absolute insane amounts of chaos. Fur about to make his way through. And it's Cam versus two. KNG drops as well. That's a beautiful one versus two clutch right there. And Chaos back on the board once more. Definitely a feel-good clutch there. A feel-good round. And they close this scoreline. Cam, it's not just all about those openings. It's about how he closes these out in a way as well. Look at that response. And KNG just not quick enough on the trigger. That's got to be heartbreaking for MIBR. They pretty much had that round under wraps. KNG had the whole of out. Is that is that CT side coming up? I think that they're, they're fine just cruising here. And, well, if they keep walking in to this squeaky angle against Fallen and KNG, then they're going to have real issues here. And a massive quad kill. It's against rifles as well. So it's... Six actually got the defuse kit. And smoke in hand. So with Taco also falling. Six going to try and make his way in. Needs a bit of a ninja here, to be perfectly honest. But, oh, there's a first. Knows exactly where Taco's playing from. And when's this smoke going down and through? Oh, he's barely got any damage left. And he's going to get straight on this bomb. I don't think he's got enough time regardless. But half a second left. And he gets it. Sick. What a disgusting retake there on the B bomb site. I do not think Taco was expecting him to have the kit. But he goes down instantly. And sick. I thought that was probably going to be a... A ninja attempt, probably failing, but he takes the retake by the book. And that is, yeah, really quite nasty. Just look at this kill from behind and how he outplays one of the world's best here. Taco should be great in that scenario. Scrambles for the bomb. Way of chaos, but a two versus two. And now an opportunity, but Cam, he's still tucked inside this A-bomb site. He's going to just hold this drink this split so, so long. Oh, and he misses the shot. Taco gets a freebie. Now it's down to sick. A one versus two. That's the first. And stuck inside this corner. Knows that Fallen has to go for this cross. Four seconds left. Finally, that bomb going down. And Six going to try and make it across. Fallen. One bullet left. And Six finds it. Once again, another clutch for Chaos. They're up to 11. To apply a little more pressure. Balls of steel to just tap E. And instead, Fallen sat upon the ramp. They have to find another quick kill. Sidelining angle taken. Fallen. It all comes down to these headshots. Oh, and he nails them! What the hell was that? Smooya versus two. This is all falling apart. Fallen might have just done it. That's going to be 14 to 14. 
And unfortunately, while well, the cameraman was definitely expecting something completely different, instead we capture some sad, sad faces there. Is fallen, able to crush some dreams. The captain secures the 14th, and there are no celebrations yet for MIBR. Look at this spray away. We finally capture it. That third headshot is just so, so disgusting. Now in slow motion again. Nasty stuff. Yeah, the spray onto Cam, that's fine. Four drops and smooth your sick. Both finding kills. It's fallen again versus three. You get spotted in the open, and well, there's an initial headshot, and this starts to get dangerous. Smooth throws that Molotov down and away. Vanity through the smoke. Needs to make a play. Out in the open, fallen another time. He closes the door on Vanity, and this now becomes chaos. He makes a weird jump, and I don't know if that's going to bake and fake Vanity out of this one. When's he going to crack open Squeaky Door? He looks scared of the tactician right here. This might be back-to-back -back triples from Fallen as he plants that bomb. Right onto this bomb site, and well, there goes the nade. Oh, and Vanity dunks it. Beautifully played. Chaos looked like it was almost inevitable that Fallen was going to close this one out, but it's 15. Chaos first.